want you guys to name the slime. So I don't really know what to call this slime, but the things you'll be needing are chia seeds, cornstarch, dish soap, and some hot water. So this slime has no glue, no borax, no contact lens solution, nothing like that. So let's get started. You're going to be needing a spoon and take your chia seeds and put it on top of a strainer with some hot water because you don't want the seeds in the water. So, yeah. Oops. So basically fill up the strainer with the chia seeds so that they can absorb the water. And then set it aside. All right, so step two is you wanna take your dish soap, any dish soap will work, and squirt some into your bowl. Depending on how big you wanna make it is how much dish soap you're gonna to wanna to use. So I'm just gonna go ahead and use that much. And go ahead and add in some cornstarch. You don't need a ton just yet, so I'm adding in about two teaspoons of it and stirring that together. It might look a little weird and chunky, but it'll work itself out soon. Alright, so that's what our mixture looks like. So now we're going to go ahead and grab our chia seeds. Alright. And take your spoon and just stir them around in the water. Like so. And chia seeds do absorb. Alright. So I'm going to go ahead and take them out of the water. and dump them into my mixture. It's okay if not all of them were fully absorbed, we just need some of them to be. All right, so go ahead and start stirring your chia seeds into the soap and cornstarch mixture. And then go ahead and add in some more chia seeds. A lot more. And there is no exact recipe for this. Alright, so now you're going to leave this to sit for about a minute or two so that the cheese seeds can absorb all the excess soap. So it's been about a minute now and here's what our seeds look like. So go ahead and stir it. You guys will see it's very thick now. So now what you can do is go ahead and stir in some cornstarch just a little bit. Sprinkle by sprinkle. Alright guys, so now I'm going to go in with my hands. I'm going to dip them in some cornstarch first. And then we're going to start working with the chia seed mixture. I'm actually going to go ahead and take it out of the bowl. Sprinkle the top with cornstarch. Just to make sure nothing sticks.
So this slime isn't very slime. It's kind of like a butter slime slash clay. I'm not really sure what to call it. But here's my finished product after kneading it for a little while. So let me know down below what you guys think I should call this. It is super duper fun to play with. It's not sticky at all. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe to come an official minion. And don't forget to hit that bell to member of the Simon Minion Fam and Notification Squad. Hope you guys all enjoyed. Love you guys all so, so much. And... Peace.